Quilt Entertainment channel. All right, so I do have another microphone coming. I know I had some trouble the past couple days, but it's all okay. We're gonna use this old microphone that I found. And yeah, I got a brand new one coming, but it's all good. That's neither here nor there. All right, so today we're gonna be playing some good old Jeruid, or pretty much the Primalist is what it is when you first get them. Uh, that's what it is from the beginning part. All right, but it's all good. But it's the first time you guys have joined, guys, and you guys love some Swill Entertainment. Hey guys, you guys love. Sorry about that. Yeah, make sure you guys subscribe and all that good jazz. Follow and all that. All right, so let's see what we got. Um, let's see what we got here, man. All right. There we go. Let me see where I left off at. Now, this character is level like 17 ish. Oh, 18. I'm 18. Oh, short changing myself. Don't want to do that, my friends. Don't want to do that. Let me check something else out really quick here. Definitely want to short change myself. So let's see. Where do we have to go quest wise? I'll get one of these characters up to. um. level 100 at some point we'll do it I almost guarantee it all right so we need to do let me see best thing to do is so we got going on here is this oh, we could travel here let's go travel here get that little bit of travel action here now it's like minimal stuff and it's a pretty strong character guys i think i might have messed up the build just a little bit now, when I was like level like five, I was just like, what? This is a monster. All right. So yeah, literally he is a monster. All right. So let's go ahead and get some leveling. So stay tuned for the journey and all that good stuff, guys. If you want to see some more, make sure you guys uh, just follow and uh, see what you can see. Promise it will be worth your while. Make sure if you guys are watching on YouTube, make sure you guys drop a like. So we're going to go ahead and get some pets. I haven't played the character in like a couple days. Because I wasn't able to stream it. Oh yeah, I forgot about totems, man. These totems do the work for you. The pets do the work for you. And I can summon two, no, three totems actually. Yeah, be careful. And I'll show you guys what I'm using for my build, man. It's just leveling. That's all. I'm experimenting just a, a wee bit. You want to put your totems out there. Let your totems do all the work. Let them get hit. You can summon them again. Can't summon yourself again. You gotta start all over. As far as like the direction goes. Um but right now I'm using the good old um was it crows? And I've been switching out skills left and right. So let's look at what we got what I got going on right now. Alright, so my skills right now, I am using Maelstrom. And I'm also using Thorn Totem. Now, as far as where the points are going, I'm still kind of iffy on that. I always want to put out more damage. So that's what I'm looking at doing, is putting out more damage as much as I can. That's where we're going there. Same thing with the totems. I um, think this is what makes you... Yeah, this is as uh, you can add an additional Thorns Totem active, but some Thorn Totems cost more mana. That part sucks until I can get... Um, sorry about that. I could probably get something a little bit better. But right now, this is what I'm working with, just experimenting, because you can always respect, and you guys know how that goes. All right, so looking at my good old skillage, I am using Totems, Maelstrom, Crowstorm, and Howls. Yeah, that's what we got going on there. Now, I did use a couple of these other ones as well. Um, I did Upheaval. It's pretty decent. Uh, it just makes like a... Uh... I'll show you real quick. In case you guys are wondering what it does, it does that. You know, of course, you want to put points into it if you want to get it better. Then you have the little Atera's Blessing, which is going to heal you pretty for the most part. Um, nearest allied target is healed for 100 health. If the target is one of your minions. Then the he uh, healing is tripled in, um, and the minion is energized for four seconds, increasing its size for 20 seconds of the damage. That's kind of cool. But once they start taking damage, then it's going to help them out. Then I got the War Cry, unleash a mighty roar that knocks back nearby enemies and stuns them for 1.5 seconds. Rares and bosses are stunned 
for half as long. Okay, I don't really use that one. Then we got Swipe, Tempest Strike, yada, yada, yada. But I'm not using those. Ice Thorns is pretty cool. I was using that for a little while. But like I said, I'm experimenting for the most part. All right, so, damn, I forgot what I had on here, man. Oh, Crows. But it turned it into something else. Oh, well. Can't be too important, guys, right? If I didn't see it, it didn't happen. I gotta get, like, where my buttons are pretty much ergonomical for me. I want to summon these things, but I want to use up all my mana. Because you use mana, then you can't do anything else. Get those totems out there. I got two, but I can do three. But look at the mana, man. It just goes away. But look at the damage. That's what really matters. Put the crows out there. Level 19, baby. Yeah, yeah. Hey, what's going on here? Oh, snap. Woo, look at that. All right, so also to go along with this, I just want to do a couple of attacks just to show show what's going on here. You got the howl, man. The companion ability of your primal wolves. Um or the companion ability. Uh, the wolves howl and embolden themselves and allies around them, granting them frenzy and 50% increased damage for three seconds. You want to keep on casting that as much as you can, man. You want to put these totems out. You see the little circles go around the feet? That's how you know it's it's it's, it's what it is, man. It's, it's working like working as intended. Got that intendage. Well, hopefully I can stream this game a lot more. Because I, I really do enjoy it. Can't wait till the multiplayer comes out. But I mean it is what it is. You can play by yourself in this and it's still okay. You just have that whole loneliness feeling for the most part. But you do have the chat. And chat is going ham, big time. I'm not sure if there's any updates coming out anytime soon. Make sure you got Maelstrom up as much as you can put up. And these guys. I know sometimes I do lose my wolf. They die sometimes. You know, their, their health is only but so much. Put these, go, put these guys up. All right, come on, Maelstrom, help me out. Help me out. Woo! Too many mobs, man. Still, still pretty overpowered, man. Still overpowered. I'm. I really do enjoy it. I'm gonna be playing this all weekend, guys. I got a three-day weekend, so yeah, I'm excited. Hope I can get this class up to where I need to get it. Druid is the way to go, man. Ew, my god. Yeah, man, these spiders, dude. These spiders are annoying. Guess okay, where my wolf? Okay, wolf is still there. I think. No, he just died. The wolf just died. Where'd he go? We gotta stand in this thing, right? Oh. Oh, so you stand in there as summons. Okay, it reses them back when you do that. Okay, okay, okay. I thought that was like some kind of secret thing. Because I said, I've never seen that on any other character. So just seeing that part right there, that that makes sense. Okay. Hey, little Bobby. Just keep on 
At some point, when we start getting some more points in, we'll be able to um, get more mana back, hopefully. Um, I'm kind of reluctant to put more points in this one to get summon another totem. But four totems would be kind of cool. But I don't think we can put any more right now. I don't know. Can we? I don't even know. So, yeah, I think that's as far as we're going to go. Because I don't think we really need to summon any more totems. Uh, you ready to gain mana when Thorn Totem dies? That may be a possibility. Um, Thorn Totem has a chance to poison enemies. That's going to get gotten. And then Thorn Totem gains a chance to freeze. And 50% of their base physical damage is converted to cold damage. Consequently, its damage is now scales with increase to cold damage. All poison chance from this tree is converted to chill chance. Huh. And all increased poison duration from the tree apply chill duration instead. So, I mean, this may be okay. I mean, I kind of like the poison damage because I guess it's like a damage over time thing. But, I mean, still, if you go in there with the chill and it slows them down or whatever, yeah, that might be kind of good too. And then possibly with the Frost Attunement, Thorn Totem has a higher chance to freeze enemies and greater chance to freeze enemies for each point attunement you have. Those might be some good ones right here, guys. I don't really know. I think I'm going to go with this right here. Regain mana when Thorn Totem dies. I need my mana. So I don't have any points. I thought I had some points to put in. I guess not. Okay, so I guess it's the passives. We got passive point to put in. That's where we have to go. All right, so I've been putting points more or less into uh, Wisdom of the Wild. Yeah, Wisdom of the Wild, I think that's the route I'm going to be going. And then at that point, I think then I will be going into Beast Ma Oh, actually, no, Druid. Now, I don't know if Beastmaster is good or Shaman is good. I'm going to have to do some search on there before I actually decide on the class I'm going to go. But so far from what I've seen, I've seen the Druid looking pretty nice. Looks pretty nice. And that. It's not bad. At some point, like I said, when I got like about, I must say, I kind of like, I noticed it was getting a little weak around nine and 10, the levels. I was like, man, what happened? Lots of experimentations, what was going on. But still, a real enjoyable character. I just need to start getting some better gear. This gear's not dropping, man. I'm not getting anything. Well, yeah, I am getting some uh, uniques. I'm not going to put it out there like I'm not getting them, guys. I'm a very, this is a very lucky character. Well, this is a lucky account. I'm getting all kinds of uniques. It's a whole bunch of them in my stash. All right, so that is good. Oh, we're gonna die. <laughs> Get my little doggy back here, man. All right, we got him. And I think I'm going to say what? What am I doing? Oh, okay, that's what I was doing. Okay, make sure I got my, all my health potions. On going with this quest because I got like I said, we need to unlock um druid. I just gotta look and see what shamans can do and beastmaster. I don't know. I guess beastmaster, you're just gonna summon a whole bunch of the little the pets. But so far, this is pretty good. I need like the little jump spell uh skill, but I don't want to sacrifice like maelstrom and I don't want to sacrifice like the pets. Right now, these guys are doing the work and totems. I don't want to sacrifice any of that stuff. So far, very enjoyable to me, I think. Three totems, I think, is sufficient. I don't think I need any more than that. But I need like a I need some kind of speed um jump. That little jump thing I had, I need to bring that back. But I don't see what I can probably get rid of. Maybe the crows? The crows are probably the thing that I would probably get rid of, but they do okay. The wolf is pretty much the best thing so far.
Maelstrom. Maelstrom doesn't really do too much as far as... Well, it does. I'm not going to say it doesn't do too much. I'm going to say it doesn't do too much if you hit it more than once. That's what I was trying to figure out. If I need to do like more than one Maelstrom or... And I don't even know... And I, I I did this without using a shield, and that was like the biggest mistake of all. Man, I was dying like crazy amounts of time. So I think with this build, I'm gonna keep a shield on at least, for the very least. Keep all this going. Now, if you guys want to follow me on social media, you guys can. I'm gonna put a link. Actually, you know what? Let me see if I can do that now. I don't even know. I don't know how YouTube works, but Twitch is a little bit different, guys. Um, can you edit this stuff? Well, anyway, there'll be a link in the description with a link tree, so you guys can um, follow me on all social media there. Because I do stream on YouTube as well. Same name. You swill entertainment there. So you guys can look me up there as well. But I'm trying to really focus on, on Twitch as much as I can. I do I also stream on Facebook just like an, as an experiment, just to see. But, I mean, it is what it is, guys. I got nothing but time. But I want to do... I do want to conquer Twitch. Twitch and its madness. So you guys that are just joining here, welcome, welcome. Playing some Last Epoch, one of the best games of 2021 and beyond, I might add. I would not lie to you guys at all. I think this is a really fantastic-ass game. Really do. All right, so we're not getting to any quests. What's going on? Like, where the hell are we? Okay. We gotta get these quests, man. Like, I haven't seen a quest done in a minute. Oh. I'm gonna follow the pets because they're the ones that are doing all the work. I'm just gonna do like some little bit of supplemental DPS, and that'll be about it. I guess the more you push the maelstrom, oh, I didn't know this. Yeah, buddy, keep that thing. My thing be thinking now, boy. Look at that. But it doesn't give you like a bar. Oh, it does. It tells you. Oh, six. See, I thought it was being on the top part. Like this is right here. It tells you. All right, so I got six maelstroms going. That's pretty strong, I guess. I just need some more mana. So six is my, the most I think I can get. Okay. I see you, maelstrom. See, I only learn when I play this game with you guys. When I stream it, only time I learn. Cold resistance shard, all that good jazz. I can't do anything else. I'm damn sure gonna pick up my gold. I'm not gonna pass that up, bad boy. Oh snap, here they come. Get my six maelstroms in there or anything close to it. Look at that, that's nice. I think this is good. This is overpowered, man, so far. I like it. This guy's health is going down somewhat. You get some totems out there. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Come on. Who who couldn't love this? Man, oh man. Fantastic buying. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah, I remember this part. You got your little chest right here. Uh, which is archive one. I think that this, I don't know the best weapon to use, but I think that the scepter, what I have, is, is pretty decent, man. I'm using a scepter. Not bad. Like I said, I'm not really worried about my weapons. 
I just want to make sure. Oh, look at that. We're about to hit about to hit 20, guys. And we'll probably be like 25. Something like that before we even get to um choose our what's it called? The uh base class. Or not base class, but the uh I'm gonna call it secondary class. All right, so that's a two-handed spear, but like I said, I don't wanna I don't wanna get rid of um my shield. Wait, we gotta go back to travel east beyond the ruins of Wellrun. First for this, I don't know. Return to Genova at Council Chambers. I don't want to go back to the Council Chambers yet. I just want to get these some of these quests done. Knock out what I can, and then go from there. To me, that makes sense. So just you know, turning quests back in and running back to town, and it just takes too long. Because these are long runs when you do your stuff. It's, it's long runs. All right, so at some point we need to go back down here. Let's go ahead and get some maelstrom. We got get a totem out here. We'll pre-set up a, a maelstrom or two. And look like something is attacking the totem. Oh, these guys are bold, boy. Level twenty. So this armor is a little bit better. Actually, it's a lot a bit better. So we're gonna put that on. That's probably gonna help with our survivability more than likely. Because I know I was struggling for a second. All right. Come on, pets. Let's go. Doing better than you guys. Oh, you're struggling with this. This guy. Dude, let me get my gold, boy. But I, I definitely need to get some, like, speed. I, I do notice this. I'm running a little... I took away the jump. The jump helped out with a small cooldown, but it was still pretty good. All right, so like I was saying, okay, so Maelstrom got, oh, we can put another point here now or another um skill. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, what would I put there, though? That's the thing. Uh... Pretty much everything that would go there is like druid stuff. Like all the stuff that I would put here would be druid things. However, I will probably like to use the jump, like I was saying, the jump. But I don't really want to put, I mean, I'm going to use the jump, but I don't need to put points into it because it's not really, it doesn't really serve too much of a purpose to me, honestly. It's like, eh. But I mean, the wolf, I right, put some points in his, his stuff for now. Specialize it, and then we can put some points. So we, the wolf is always going to be out. So let me see. Wolves have increased attack and move speed. That might might be kind of good. Um, your wolves have more health. Your wolves have additional dodge chance and increased dodge rating for each point. Wolves have a chance to howl on the kill. That is fantastic. Legendary bite. It's got they got a lot of stuff, man. These wolves, they putting a lot of stake in these dudes, man. These little dudes. Alright, these little homies. I didn't want them to attack faster. Increase um attack and move speed. That's gonna be okay. Let's put those points there. And we'll just kind of like figure out what we're gonna do later on with that. Because I think that's gonna that's gonna hold us over just for a little bit, I think. Um Maelstrom, I don't even really know where I want to go with this. Um, turbulent maelstrom deals more damage. Bonus doubled if you have at least 60 attunement. What is attunement? That's what I need to figure out. What is that? The maelstrom stacks have longer duration. Why would you not want to use that? That's fantastic. To me, that makes sense. Instead of having to cast it every single time. And then my passive points, I'll keep putting it here. And now I think we got that serpent strike unlocked now. That's cool. Kind of curious to see what that one does i wish we could do this move button change the move button instead of having to have it just for moving let me put a skill on there diablo 3 you can do it
Yeah, I'm not trying to go that one, that route. I need to get more mana, though. Whether I need more mana pool or whatever. I need something. But this is by far not, I'm not me, not me griping or anything like that. I'm not complaining. This is, this is fantastic. So all you guys that are dropping in, say hi. What's up? Don't be shy. Don't be nervous. Okay, we got him. We got him. Okay, so like I said, I don't want to sacrifice the wolves. I don't really want to sacrifice the, the crows. But for now, leveling, this is what's going to help me out. I think. Let's get some maelstroms in there. I think it takes all my mana. The stacks. Okay, we have seven, eight, eight maelstroms, man. Good lord, yes. All right, so I'm going the. Okay, I'm going the right way. Shoot, we can go this way. There's a quest down this way. Look at this, man. These guys. Totem who? <laughs> There's a wand. I don't think this is going to be good for wands. Now, as far as the wolf doing more damage, I don't see it, but I'm sure he is. I just see myself, my, my health going down. I need like a bear or some kind of tank. Good old bloody tank. Bloody. Bloody. Ooh, what is this? A tune dream catcher of remedy. More health. Increased minion health, mana attunement. Yeah, let's get that plus two attunement. That's gonna probably be what we need. Let's put that on, let's transfer, let's sort. And I haven't really been looking at a lot of the gear that I've been getting, the drops, not so much. The dagger might be better, it's fast. Let's put that sucker on. All right, let's check it out. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Okay, I see you. I see you. I'm really excited though. I like this. This is not bad. This is <laughs> this is what I like. All right, somehow we need to go over there. So I need these maelstroms to come on. I need this mana to come on, boy. I think this thing will be so overpowered. Staff, I don't care about the staff. I don't care about no raggedy staff, man. No staff for me. Keep that staff out my face. Get 
that staff out my face, my friend. All right. So somehow I missed something. Get to the next area. What's up? We need to get up there. So maybe I have to run down this way. Shoot. Look at that gold, though. Think myself later when I'm even respecting like a champ. Glyph of Despair. Let's go. Ward retention. Okay. We'll put that on. And then increase poison damage, poison damage. Health converted. 13% of potion health converted to ward. Is that a good thing? Ward must be good. Already got that one on that one. It was kind of pointless to even change that out. That's nice, though. Ward must be a good thing. Ucha. Now I'm taking things slow. I could run through here a little bit more. Up oh, 21. I could run a little bit more fast if I wanted to, but right now I think I'm going to take it a little bit easily. I don't want to die. All right, here we go. More mobs coming out. Crows, man. These guys are raping face to my damn mana. My health is going down. I mean, it's going up slowly. I'm just trying to test it out a little bit here. See how much damage I can really do. Or I have to really, really, really heal. I think so far, I mean, I'm alright. Bastard sword. I like how they call everything bastard. All right, let's not put too much stock in the maelstrom here because we really need some totem action. Stuck. I'm stuck. Oh! My wolf died, and then I died. Damn, man, we got to run all the way there? God. All the way up here. We got to kill all this stuff, man? Oh, shoot. So we stand here. We got to get our... That's how we res our pet. That's kind of lame. I'm not going to lie. It's a cool feature, but I'd rather just summon him back up. I guess that's not a thing we do here. Like, who's summoning these damn crows, man? There's a whole bunch of these guys. Oh, this thing is doing it, probably. Jeez. All right, so I got a passive point to put in. And these damn crows are still getting summoned, brother. And my, my wolf is dead, of course. Right, here he comes. Resurrected.
Hey, no wolf. Bring yourself back over here. 30 ward when hit. Hold on a second. Yeah, I think ward when hit. Let's check that out. I'm not really sure, but I think that might be better. When I get hit, if I get, I'm getting hit, so why not get ward from it? Whatever ward is. So possibly. All right, pets, y'all need to come this way. We're not fighting out now. They're gonna, they're gonna drag everything they didn't hit over there all the way my way. I'm trying to have the easy, easy uh, run here. Man, we gotta fight all this crap. Got him. All right, let me run. Let me run a little bit. Let's zoom through here a little bit. Whoever dies, dies. As long as it's not me. I don't want to fight every last thing, man. That's getting kind of monotonous. I'm ready to get into the build. I know you guys are waiting for the build. I'm waiting for the build. Because when you see something cool, you're just like, I want to try that out. See how it plays. Damn, I didn't mean that to happen. These checkpoints right here. <clears throat> Let these sucker come up here because I got four totems up. And these guys are like, everyone's dead. Hey, go on, man. Come on, guys. Oh, God. I got to rest all these dudes. I mean, no sense. I'm stuck. I can't run. All right, so I'm at my limits right now. So whatever this is, this void damage, probably void damage. <laughs> my void resistance is low as hell. Dang, gone, man. I let it happen, man. Health potions are like. No bueno, my friend. What did it shoot me from afar, bro? Die. This guy. Void Prophet of Blades. All right, so he's got a ring. Oh, God. What's summoning these damn crows, bro? All right. Now we got a breather. For a second. You about got me, man. The chest over here. Got a nice little amulet. Increase it cast speed. I'll take that anyway, just in case. Two handed weapon. Nice little wand. I think I got one already. I think. Woo! I love getting weapons, though. I don't mind. Chance to bleed on hit. Why is my... I wonder what makes the, uh, the idle spots open up more. I don't know. I gotta do some research on that one. Get this thing uncovered. I guess as levels go by, maybe. All right, so where's my crow? So we're gonna go all the way around here. Oh. Damn, we gotta run all the way back from here. Jeez. Jeez, mama.
All right. Man, I gotta be careful. I can't help it, guys. Something is going on. Something strange in your neighborhood. All right, so that's a chance to poison. But I don't understand the chance to poison because we're gonna get the, the frosty stuff anyway. So, and the wolf, his attack speed is not that great. He does need some more defense. I guess he needs more defense dodging, <laughs> I guess. Let's get him. Oh, let's go, baby. Dang. These guys again. First time I gotta summon this dude back. That is so stupid. I gotta run all the way back over here, summon him. We'll just have to put some stake in the totems here, man, because totems are they're the ones who do the most. Oh crap. They're getting stuck. Thank goodness. What do you mean no room? bad boy on I thought needs to go all this nonsense stuff gotta go this nonsense non-value added space taken This sucker right here. Where's my wolf? And this guy hits hard, boy. Got my wolf. Got him. You're in trouble now, buddy. Got the wolf. You guys watch Pulp Fiction? Who is everybody glad to see? The Wolf. Got him. Finally a quest done. All right, so there's not really much that really dropped. The scepter is nice looking, I guess, but I mean, it is what, I guess freezing. I guess we're going to be using that anyway. So that's going to help us out. But I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this old nice little stream up here, guys. I just wanted to test this microphone out a little bit. Hopefully everything was sounding okay, but I got a new one coming. So we're going to go with that. But hey, thanks so much for joining and all your support, guys. Thanks, 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 and thanks. We'll see you next time.